Hi everyone, and welcome to Unity Reflect. Today we're going to talk about a feature called multi-user. Multi-user enables multiple users with Unity accounts to open the same project that is coming from the same source. They can collaborate in the same space regardless of their device. Some could be on a tablet, using Android or iOS. They could be using a Mac or they could be using a PC. And all collaborating together with voice chat and the ability to see what each is selecting and doing. So without any further ado, let's jump in and explore the multi-user feature. When we first launched the Unity Reflect review application, we we're first greeted by the Projects tab. Here we get to see the projects that we have, the server they're coming from, the organization they're part of, when they were modified, and most importantly, who are the current collaborators that are in real time. Those are delineated by a color swatch that is assigned to each individual with their initials in it. Let's start collaborating. So let's jump right in and start doing our design review. As you can see, we have the stakeholders logged in. I'm kind of zooming in and trying to find out where they are and what the area of interest is. But better yet, let's use Follow Camera. Follow Camera is a feature that allows us to basically go into the camera of what the other user is, is viewing. As you can see, I just went to Brian's camera to see what he was looking at. What this allows us to do is get the exact context of what that viewer sees. Instead of just listening to what they're saying, we can actually view their viewpoint. The next thing I'm going to show is share a link. This allows us to share a link so we can invite other stakeholders if they need to be part of this meeting. Then I can also mute myself or unmute myself. As remember, this has full featured voice chat, which also allows me to mute other users if they're in a noisy location or if we don't need their input. Next, we're gonna cover multi-user selection. Now we understand why every user gets assigned a unique color. When they select to view the BIM information on an object, that object is highlighted and color-coded with the color assigned to that user, and all the stakeholders have the ability to view what each one is viewing. As you can see, I'm going to select the BIM information for another object. And here, it has been color-coded to the color assigned to myself. I can go through and view the different filters as I would normally. Again, these are some of the very cool features that make Unity Reflect Review such a powerful tool for fast and efficient design review.